Hello and welcome, my name is Matt. I'm from the YouTube channel and web blog DIY Data. And here at my work today, we have a Inner Genie a share to you that I'm having to play around with. So I thought I would make a quick little video to test it, um, how to play around, worked out a few things with it so far. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd make a quick video. Um, if I give you a quick look at the box, that's the Inner Genie share to you. It is actually running and recording this. And if I go to camera, we can have a look at the box. So the audio in this uh, setup follows the USB device, unfortunately. So, which is okay with these. These, you just get a different um, audio level between the two cameras. It just sounds a bit different. But the big issue is, and it's a bit of an annoyance in the way we were kind of looking at using it, is if I go picture in picture, in picture now, I, now have I have an echo. Echo, echo, echo. echo, echo. echo. Um, um, there seems to be a bit of delay on it, but um, what am I doing here? Go back to camera one. So, my setup here is the Inner Genie um, taking USB cameras. So the two USB cameras I have are, you can see the little Microsoft webcam up on the monitor here. Just a little, uh, it's like a 720p monitor, I think it's not even full HD. Um, that and I might as well go to that camera and spin it around. And you can see the Logitech uh, meter. So that is my second camera. And uh, what we can do is, if I grab this one and come down here, I can show you how it's connected. I wish I could keep audio from the meetup right now because now I'm handling this camera. Probably going to get a bit rubbish audio. But yeah, you can see you can take either one USB and one HDMI or one U or two USB camera inputs. The HDMI out is a local monitor, so you, you get a preview of what's coming out. So if you have picture in picture or whatever um, comes up, you get that. There's also LAN control and host 232 control. If we go over to the front, you get. These are two USB inputs, so basically that these two on the front are a uh, USB hub, so you can plug anything into it really. And that's USB to the computer. So if we go back up here and slip this one back up to up there, um, basically this is the yeah Inner Genie share to you. There's also a share two, I think that's I'm not sure the difference with that one. That might have a US not might not have the HDMI in or something. But neat little unit. My biggest annoyance is the two camera, two camera delay, delay echo, echo and a, a big battery, battery if you pick, pick one, one of the inputs or took the audio, audio from, from the first, first input. input. But unfortunately, but unfortunately it doesn't. It does. It does. Unfortunately it doesn't. But that's something you can work around, I suppose. Either um, do something like, if you can... I can mute the audio on the uh, Logitech Meetup and then the only audio that's coming through now should be on the Microsoft WebKit. But that's kind of annoying because it's going to probably default to the audio being unmuted. And the way we're looking at using these things is setting it up in a way that shows... Um, sorry, the way we're looking at using this is a way, kind of standalone system that is constantly in, in play. So if a teacher comes in and tries to use stuff, they can. Um, 
Yeah, basically, that's that. Um, but, uh, yeah, so we can unmute the, the meetup meet again, again and if we, go. if we go back to the meetup. This is audio coming from the meetup. I don't have the extension mics plugged in or anything. Um, it's literally just the meetup um, microphone array in it, however that works. And then just to compare, this is the little Microsoft 720p camera that is actually currently being a bit overexposed right now, but that's okay. Um, yeah. So, what I might do, if I grab this guy down here, and come down here and look at these little two ports down here, I have worked out that audio input, as soon as you plug a input into it, it does mute the cameras. So, that is a workaround that you could do if you were having a... Can I get this in here? Get this in here. Can I get a bit of a back shot if I can of that? A little bit wobbly. So, yes, um, what was I saying? Oh, the audio input. As soon as you plug in a 3.5mm jack into it, it uh, mutes the USB audio, which is something that we might be able to use if we were using something like, let me just give it here, a Samson USB mic. I mean, these are USB, so you could plug this into USB on the front or straight into the computer and take the USB off it. But you can use the, the the receiver has a little headphone output, so you can potentially plug that into the inner genie and use that. But yeah, basically that's it. Or you could use another microphone, like if you had a some kind of tabletop microphone with a audio output, it's 3.5 mil out, so there's no um, RCAs or XLRs or anything, but that's okay. Uh, or you could plug a mixer in. Plug a little Behringer mixer or a little any any mixer that you can, so you can plug any mic into it. Or anything, and because it is a USB system, depending on how you're wanting to do this setup, you could use any microphone here, you could use any USB, like a P1, what are they, Chat160. As long as your recording software allows you to pick the microphone, basically. So, to record this little test, I'm using OBS on my desktop. Um, I was trying to use the Windows 10 um, camera app and that should work however with my computer it wants to record to my home profile which is on a network there's not enough hard drive space on for server space assigned to me so I can't actually do that which is annoying but yeah so overall this inner genie inner genie share to you is actually a pretty neat product it is fairly pricey at basically 2,000 US dollars, so I think it's about 3,000 Australian dollars. Um, relatively pricey, you might say, but for the, the use case of it, it's actually not too bad. Um, if you pair this up with a meetup and a second camera, like just a Logitech webcam, probably something I'm using uh, just a 720p camera to test, but I'd probably recommend sticking with like a HD one to match the primary camera. Um, yeah, the other 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 potential use case is um, presenter camera and a USB document camera. So if you're doing like a maths based or something where you have equations and you like to write, you can be talking to the camera and you can have the document camera and pick up your writing. You could also have the primary camera 
HDMI input out of your laptop in here. Um, the two two USB inputs into output into one stream makes things quite handy because it allows you to get that side by side capture. Again, the biggest issue with that is the audio. Um, I might do another test at some point when I get a chance to test it with a document camera. See if document camera. The only issue with that would be yeah, if you're on document camera and the document camera doesn't have any sound at all, then you're not going to get any sound. Um, in our use cases, the, probably the best option so far is to actually use an external microphone of some description, I guess. Either a USB one into the computer or a probably best option is actually something that goes into the in a genie, this camera's falling down. Best option would be yeah, a camera that goes, a microphone that goes straight into this side, which is the 3.5 input, because then every, everything's summed up into one camera. Um, sorry, one USB stream, and there's only so much you can do. Okay, I'm rambling a bit now, um, so I'm going to I'm going to stop it here and uh, see how this looks on playback. And if it works any good, I might upload it so you can have a look and see for yourself if you like the Inner Genie Share to You teamed up with a Logitech Meetup, a Microsoft webcam. See if it's something that anybody else might find interesting. Anyway, I'm Matt, my YouTube's DIY Data, my blog is diydata.wordpress.com. I don't update it too much, but I do try to put some interesting things up there occasionally. Um, I'm going to get back to doing work stuff, so have a good one.